All right, guys, here's our indoor unit here. Looking for a new system. It'll be new return draft. We're very limited on space, so I got about 28 inches from that wall to this water heater. So we're going to do a new return draft. We'll move it over as much as we need to. Uh, I told the customer we may have to end up cutting that trim on the wall, a little baseboard trim, so we can shoot, move our unit all the way up against that wall. We've got flexible electric. Line sets will be new. They go out the wall right there. So. The return drop, filter wise, we're probably gonna do on the bottom. So we'll do a box filter, air handler. I'll put on here whether we're gonna be doing a media or just a one inch filter. Depends on space. Four drain this year, we're gonna do a new Honeyball thermostat. So if you get in here, that's the garage. You can walk through the garage. Got a return down here already in the basement. And then the breaker box is in the garage there on the far side. All right, guys, here's a unit outside. New disconnect, new whip, new lines coming through. We're going to cut this wall rack off, set the unit on the ground. Uh, confirm with homeowner if he just wants it straight back in the same spot or if he wants to move it over at all or if he wants to move it that way. So we'll set that there. So Brad, take a grinding wheel, cut that down as low as you can. Cut that off so we can get rid of that. Over poured the concrete, just covered it up. And you got a gate on that side to get back here. 